Hi, Pam Jenian. I'd love to share the story about this painting. Uh, this is a painting of prophetic art. This is a new journey I'm on and I'm just loving it. Uh, this painting means a real lot to me because I actually didn't know until the end what it meant. Uh, while I was painting it, I was really uh, questioning God and saying, what is this about? You know, I don't understand it. And it, So anyway, at the end, he did tell me what it was. So basically, I remember on the day uh, when I have a painting day with a very close friend and we get together once a week and we paint prophetically. So basically, we put our canvases on an easel and we put our colours on the easel. We have worship music going and we just soak. We soak in the spirit of the music and God's Holy Spirit. And we are desiring for a work of art to come forth and using this, this exercise or technique, whatever you want to call it, this painting came that day so uh, that day I didn't have a canvas and so we went down to the local opportunity shop and I found this canvas but I didn't like it because it had these circles on it and it hadn't been painted on it was all white but it had these circles there and, and there was no other canvases so I thought oh, I'll just grab I'll have that one so I took it back, started painting, and I honestly put layers of gesso and paint over them, trying to get rid of those circles because I didn't like them. But they just wouldn't disappear. And so in the end, I thought, oh, well, I've just got to accept the circles are there and God just use them. You know, I don't know what they are. So basically, at the end of the painting, I asked God, what, what is the story of this painting? I don't, I don't understand it. It's, you know, I need to have a story with my paintings or they just don't mean anything to me because I want the viewer to understand what they mean and to be drawn to God through them. So I heard the Holy Spirit say that the circles were the chains that had been broken over my life and I said what are the crosses there's like one two three four five six crosses there well, what could that be and he said they are the crosses that you've had to bear and of course you know that just like hit me as the truth I know that's the truth it's very personal to me and so this painting absolutely means so much to me. So I just hope you enjoy that story.